Sup nerds, we are back for part 16, I want to say. Yeah, part 16 of the Dragon Age 2 playthrough with live commentary. Uh, we're actually in the middle of uh, Low Town Market or something, something like that. Either way, High Town Market, I want to say. And we're shopping around for no reason, even though I have like a really good at weapons and stuff. Alright, let's actually get some of these quests done and stop messing around in shops. Alright, we got people up here we gotta talk to, as designated by this little arrow. Chantry Courtyard. Up we go into the Chantry. Good day to you. So you know something either illegal or exciting is going to happen because that's all that happens in the Chantry. All the slavers, smugglers, drug addicts, they're all in the Chantry and you gotta love it. Trippy. Trippy symbol. Come on. Okay. Apparently we're going upstairs. Bust open this door. Up. Oh, here we go with the single chain link fences again. The only thing known in the world to keep me out of place is the single link chain link fence. Also utilized in the guardsman area of the map. Last time. Some frame issues there. We won't speak of that, though. Occupy Noi, North, Brother, Plinth. Oh. Look what I found. Your reason for living. <laughs> what a dick. Oh, we leveled up. That means we have good news. We can spend our points in assassination. Alright, we're gonna go with two decks and one cunning as usual. 75% damage increase, huh? Okay, let's see what we can do here. We got one specialization point, and we're going with an assassin. What does this do? Oh, mark of death. I know what it does. I wrote a guide on it. Bloodlust. Assassinate. Devious harm. Devious harm. Critical damage. This one is really important to get. Especially if you're going to be playing uh, the rogue. This right here is by far, I think, one of the best abilities in the game, hands down. Because you know you're going to be investing a lot, a lot of points in cunning. And if we go and we look at my stats right now, I actually want that, thank you. Uh, if we go and we look at my stats right now, you will see yourself. Yeah, I do want to assign this, actually. Uh, we're going to assign it to, uh, yeah, we're definitely going to assign it to Owen. I'm just going to put both burst arrow on the R2 slash uh, square because I don't use it that much. Alright, now we got a bunch of other points we can spend. And this should open up some uh, things we can do here. Points in Archery 3. Rapid Pinning Shot. I don't know why that doesn't save. Every time I pick that freaking ability, it never saves. Lance. And what does this do? Smoking Arrow obscures your party for 100% chance. Actually, gonna just save our last point until we find something a little more useful. I'm gonna assign this to, uh. Ah, oh, sorry, Mabari Warhound. You are now no longer on my bar. I've pretty much graduated from you. Too many abilities now. Okay. Dude, how the hell do I get out of this? Okay, that's what I want. It won't let me leave unless I spend all my points, huh? Here, are you happy now, game? I've spent them all. And this guy, as I was saying before, I wanted to give him Bianca's song, but he doesn't get that to level... 10, huh? Oh, he hasn't leveled up yet. What a bum. Okay, let's go. Look at that, I've spent everything. Now I've got a bunch of moves. And even though I assigned him different things, nothing assigned to the right place, so we're gonna have to fix that again. Well, we'll assign Archer's Lance to O is fine with me. Burst Arrow on the square, yes. This we're going to assign because it is very usable. Against the harder enemies. Oh, wrong button. And we're gonna sustain sustained abilities. We only got the hound. I will hard cast that every time. Activated spells and talents. We are going to put uh, 
Let's see. We need burst arrow. It's on. We have some flash. We're gonna put on the uh, triangle. Put on the R2 triangle. There we go. Perfect. Okay. I am happy with that. The real time abilities are on my main buttons, and the abilities that pause the game and let me aim them are on my R2s. I think that's very important. You guys should always do that. That's kind of my strategy, so. That's it for the Chantry, so we're leaving now. That's that. Okay. Viscounts Keep, we can go to. Map of Occupy Kirkwall. Oh, there's a quest at Gamlin's House. We'll go to Gamlin's House real quick and get this quest over. Five minutes of time already. Unless you guys record, you really don't realize uh, how fast the time goes, especially when you're playing games like this, RPGs and stuff. Where there's a lot of menus and uh, ability picking and stuff. This is really making up a lot of the so time I'm of these videos. So I'm just saying, blood's blood and all, but you are taking advantage of what? my hospitality. It's only fair if you make wants... something of a monthly Dude, contribution. You sold my children into servitude. Now you're asking me to uh -oh. pay rent? Uh, maybe just put something towards food. You should be paying uh -oh. us, Uncle. We found Cats out of the, the will. He forgave you, Mother. Grandfather left you everything. Why am I living Here, in this shack then? This sucks. Uh, ah, I should maybe I should run. To my daughter, Leandra, I would definitely run if I was all children born of her. Go through that hole the dog the made in the uh, bedroom. In town and all associated revenues. Check out the part where Gamlin is left only a stipend to be controlled <laughs> by you. <laughs> Even his own dad knew he was a crook. Gamlin, how could you? You're the one who ran away, Leandra. What happened to love is so much more important than money. It is. You didn't even come home for the funeral. The twins were a week old. We all have our burdens. Mine was looking after a life you abandoned. How long was I supposed to wait? <laughs> I doubt you let the ashes get cold. I took care of father. I stayed. And on his deathbed, all he could talk about was Leandra. Aww. Look, sister, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done it, but I did. And there's nothing I can do to get it back. I don't expect that, Gamlin. It's enough to know mother and father didn't Man, die angry. I want angry. my money. I don't know about you. I'll petition the Viscount for rights to reclaim the estate. Make a willing. You'll have your house back within weeks. You don't have the coin or standing to even get an audience I with the Viscount. I do have to rescue his son, I believe. We You've did got to pick up be that someone bounty. in this city to live in that house again. So that'll get us in there. Then I had better get started. He's a bridge burner. I just want to punch his face. I know I'm a violent one. I'm very violent, aren't I? I just want to punch that dude's face. All right, let's put all this Isaac armor in here. Uh... Sorry, Sir Isaac. I don't even know why you are in the game. You're useless, pretty much. <laughs> They give you useless armor for the DLC code, or whatever. Uh, and Gamlin's gonna be sleeping on the floor from now on. Why don't you go pick up something at the market? You could use some air. What? Hey! She just throws him out. Uh oh. I can't believe Gamlin stole Mother's entire inheritance. This is getting a little awkward. I mean, I can't. I'm very it. uncomfortable right now. That's the worst part. I would never turn against you. <laughs> Don't make any hasty promises. Joke all you want, but you make Gamlin look like the toad oh, he yeah. is. You know, when we went to look for that will, I thought we were doing it for Mother, for what she lost. I didn't realize how much it would mean to me to know I had grandparents who didn't hate me. <laughs> you might have been all right with the Ferelden thing, but just imagine if they'd known you were an exactly. apostate. You're such a wretch. Your guts. I was just hoping it would be different this time. Here I'm in pretty Kirkwall. sure the hate is here too. I'm just saying. We're not running away again. We're coming home. Oh, God. <laughs> 
Uh, I feel Are you so bad unhappy, for you guys. I wish I could do more for I just want to show you guys more action. And you're still dead. sitting here talking it's to people. It's killing her slowly every day. Investigating, investigating, But maybe investigating. if we can reclaim some of what she lost, it will help. I do anything to get us back a normal Why life. Why avoid the circle? Why did mother and father work so hard to keep you from the circle? Would it have been so bad? I guess at first, I was just a little girl. They didn't want to lose me. So I don't get it. You just like. And once I had, I know you're anything. born with Majory. What would but the Templars what, do you to know? an active apostate? Not just, just a one day you're walking around child. and all of a sudden you shoot a fireball out of your hand or something. I don't know. It changed their lives, your life, Carver's, all because of who I am. Sometimes I wonder if it would have been so bad to be with my own kind. To serve the Chantry, as Andraste demands. Okay, don't get too comfortable. Let's see if Mother gets I us that mansion. I don't want to call anywhere Uncle deal. Gamlin is home. <laughs> Has he moved that bowl of porridge since we've been here? It's been a year. I can't even remember what it was like to have a place of our own. I might even take the circle if they'll give me a clean bed of my well, own sheets. We'll see. We might get our estate back and be living large, large and in charge. I guess I could talk to her again, why not? Here comes another deeply emotional conversation. I think this is a picture of Mother. Oh. She looks like you. Where did you get that? Was it at the estate? You were Let there, me didn't you see me yet? <laughs> is it? <laughs> she was standing right next to me when I looted I the think chest. This is Mother's betrothal portrait from when she was supposed to marry the Comte. Look! You can see oh. the ring. I suppose it would have been a bit awkward to take yeah. it with her. I know she loved Father. I guess. I just wondered if she'd have been happier if he hadn't been a mage. If I wasn't a mage. I know that made it hard for <sighs> Mother. It's nice to have a reminder of a time when she still knew so how to So far, smile. most of the dialogue has been based around mages in the game, if you guys didn't notice yet. Pretty much 80% of the dialogue is about mages, mages getting captured, mages not getting captured, mages running away. It's getting a bit repetitive for me. Okay, we're taking Aveline. We're leaving Bethany at home because I don't want to hear about Carver or mages anymore. Taking the precaution of not having her here. Okay, Viscount's Keep, the Hanged Man. What is available at night? Duty. All right, we'll go do this one so we can go get that other uh, that one dude. I think I got it. I think I got a mail at my house. I thought I saw the symbol right before we uh, hit X. We will check afterwards. FedEx dropped off a package at my house, so I'm sure I'm sure Uncle Gamlin has already opened it and sold it or used it at some point. What happened to my package? Oh, I sold that already. <laughs> Always calling and getting I owed it the idiots. Blue rose. Oh, Especially here we go. Thugs who the Combat, baby. Dark. Red Mark, we need to kill him! Oh, that sucked. That was a waste. He died before I could kill him. I didn't expect him to, like, throw the mark at the dude. <laughs> he, like, throws it at him. That was a miss. Evelyn's doing a decent job right now, so... Very few are getting through. Nice shield back, Evelyn. She smacked that dude like that. Bitch or something. Yeah. Come on, I got, I got an archer's lance waiting for whoever wants to mess with me. Oh, here we go. All right. Nicely done. Let's loot these corners, dudes. But if you'd like to help, and then we're probably gonna have to end the video here after I loot all these guys because we're running out of time. Like I said, it just goes so fast. Nothing else, huh? Alright. I think we got time to level up one character over here. Okay. We're gonna go 20 constitution and 22 strength. Uh, let's see. What ability should I give you? I'll give you Bellow, so you can taunt from further away. 
And with Aveline getting a large manly roar, we will end the video here. So as usual, please come and watch the next part, which will be part 16, I believe. See you guys then.